What's up, y'all? So some quick fun facts, tips and tricks about 300 electrical. 300 has a very minimal electrical system. It's one of the reasons it's so great. That's pretty much most of it you're looking at right there. However, it's not very waterproofed. So there's two fuse holders and they're in these rubber boot things. If you submerge it, water's gonna get in there. Water got in one of my fuses, see the moisture in there, and it actually rusted it off. And it was, when I took it apart, the cap stayed in there and this came out. So yeah, that fuse wasn't working. Just my battery wasn't charging and stuff. Um, so the proper way to do this, you see all the extra holes I drilled down there? So I drill a few more holes here and here and here and stuff. And then I drilled the holes that were there, there were three, I drilled them out bigger. That helps water not puddle up there because that thing is completely covered in sand after just two rides. So that's one thing you can do to help, drill a bunch more holes. Another thing you can do is try to seal these up some. Um, usually on a 300, what I end up doing is buying a waterproof uh, fuse box off of another bike and wiring it up in here because almost every new Honda has a waterproof fuse box. Um, but you can pack these little caps things full of dielectric grease, close them, and then pack that whole thing full of dielectric grease and close that up. And the fuses actually last a really long time like that. So I'm gonna do that for now. You should do this before you start water riding, but if you're like me, you fix things once they're broken. So um, it wasn't even broken, of course, it's a 300, it had a kickstart, so it was kickstarting at first kick, no problem. Heat gun is key, so clean it all with degreaser and water, and then heat gun all the moisture out, then dielectric everything, put it back together, and it'll be good to go. Um, I'm gonna drill a few more holes, probably some bigger ones, just to help that uh, same thing from happening again, where that whole thing fills up with water, and it's just like a huge block of sand right there.